Would you believe us if we told you that Miseria, this creepy black and white arachnid infested puzzler, is a love story? You see, not only is the hideous spider beast that inhabits the lower half of the screen threatening your small furry life, it's also made off with your missus. To get her back, you're going to need to tap the sides of the screen to rotate the world, using gravity to reach the swirling spiral of freedom at the end. Along the way, you must avoid toppling out of the maze and into the maw of the screechy beast below. To make matters worse, each maze is littered with traps and enemies. Navigating these obstacles requires accuracy and finesse, something which the controls never quite provide. Tapping will rotate the screen a set number of degrees. Tapping and holding does the same thing. You don't get a smooth rotation, you just have to keep tapping away to shunt the maze around the screen. This makes guiding your circular protagonist through the mazes an oddly jerky and unsophisticated endeavour. You'll often find yourself in a tight spot, wishing you had one-to-one -one control of the maze. The absence of any alternative control scheme, whether touch or tilt, is frankly mystifying. Compound these control issues with a time mechanic which demands you blow up little white creatures to avoid being incinerated yourself, and you've got an experience that teeters between tense and frustrating. The handsome Limbo-esque visuals, bombastic score, and creepy-ass spider do a pretty good job of holding your attention during the game's trickier moments. However, presentation alone is not enough to compensate for the control issues and difficulty spikes. It ain't awful, and some of the mazes offer an entertaining challenge. But if the shrieking spider doesn't put you off, the controls just might. This has been James with AppSpy.com. We review, you decide.